Hey everybody, this is Roberto Blake of RobertoBlake.com helping you create something awesome today. So in today's video, we're going to talk about Filmora from Wondershare because this is one of the best affordable video editing software that you could get for under $50. I believe it's $39.99. I will have the exact price in the description below. But the reason I'm doing this video is that I, as you know, shoot DSLR video and I edit with Adobe Premiere Pro but I'm using professional level software because I do some of this as part of my living and how I bring in income, but not all of you will be able to do that right away and you need something that will help you get started. You might be shooting with your phone, you might be shooting with a point and shoot camera, and you may not be able to afford um, over $100 or $500 in video editing software. You might not even be able to afford the rental of Adobe Premiere Pro through Creative Cloud for $20 a month. So we need to find solutions that you guys can use that might be a little better than the free editing software out there. And that's why I've partnered up with Wondershare to do a video about Filmora because I think it's a really good entry level solution for you guys. Now, part of what's gonna happen here is because I now have a full license of the software is I will probably be doing some tutorials to help you guys get started. But in the meantime, I'm gonna give you guys a review and my overall impressions of the software having played with it for about a week and a half or so now and what I think is that for a beginner, for someone just getting into video editing, someone who just wants to do a basic YouTube channel, for someone who's either a student or a small business, that this software will be a good fit for you and it's under $100. It's some of the cheapest software you can get but it isn't lacking in features you do have the ability to do both a video and an audio track, something that's a little challenging sometimes in free software. It is possible to do it in something like um, iMovie or Windows Movie Maker, but I feel that one of the advantages that you have with Filmora is that it also has an uh, audio library built into it so that you can put background music in there right from the start. It also has some features in terms of effects and video styles that will help you make your video interesting and unique and have a little bit more of a polish to it. So the reality is that if you're doing basic video editing, if you're doing a talking head video like this, or if you're doing a family film, or if you're doing a short product video for your business, you could do it here in Filmora and no one would know the difference between whether you edited it here or in Adobe Premiere Pro or in Final Cut Pro in terms of the results that you're able to get because you can put in some of these features very easily that will make it look a lot more professional. You can even do overlays, you can do titles. All these things are built into the software and it's all for under $100. So who do I feel that this software is for? Would I use it personally? I'm doing a different type and style of video and with a different demand and I already have Adobe Premiere Pro as well as Final Cut Pro. But if I didn't and I was just starting out, this is something that I would buy. This is something that as a student, I would have been able to afford since it's under $50 and it's easy enough to learn. It's very intuitive in terms of how to use it. it is very comparable, but has more features than iMovie and Windows Movie Maker. So I think that that's tremendous. It can output video files in HD quality, full HD quality. So I feel that this is a solid piece of software for anybody who's just getting started, is uh, a student, a small business person on a budget, or is a new YouTuber, that this software is perfect for you. It has all the features you need, and it has features that you can grow into, and more importantly, it's gonna help you learn the basic concepts of video editing. It's gonna help you with doing simple cuts and edits. You're gonna be able to do transitions. You're gonna be able to do video styles, overlays, effects, title sequences, add background music, all the basic things that are going to make a, for a very good and interesting video. All of those capabilities are here and you can add background music without having to worry about the copyright infringement part. So that's gonna help you out if you're a YouTuber. The interface is simple and easy to use. One of the problems with um, someone going into something like Final Cut Pro or Adobe Premiere Pro is that even with getting started tutorial videos like the ones I do, it can still be a little overwhelming in terms of the interface and the options. With Formora, it's not an issue to do that at all. It is a very simple, sleek, minimalist, intuitive interface that you can use 
and you're going to be able to understand it and wrap your head around it without needing to go through long tutorials or a complicated process. So my final thoughts are if you are looking for a budget video editing solution for under $100 that's easy to use and can have you produce high quality results, then I would give Filmora a try. There's an, a link available for a free download so you can try it before you buy it, give the trial a shot, work your way through it, and really get a feel for the program. And then if you wanna buy it, it's super affordable. And I would highly recommend that you look into doing that because it's important to have solutions for the level that you're currently at. And you may not have the time to spend hours upon hours upon hours learning something complicated like Final Cut Pro or Adobe Premiere Pro right now. Eventually, I do recommend that you use high-end professional software. But until then, there's no reason for you to not get a video out because you would be overwhelmed by the need of that software. Right now, if you have to get a video out tomorrow, this program is going to let you do it. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed my review of Filmora from Wondershare. Um, again, I want to thank Filmora for getting me a license for the software so I could check it out, give you guys my impressions, and so going forward, I'll be able to make tutorial videos that will allow somebody as a beginner to edit video and not be overwhelmed by complicated software. If you still have questions, leave those in the comment section below, and I'll try and answer as many of them as I can. Like this video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out the other awesome content on the channel. As always, you guys, thanks so much for watching, and don't forget, create something awesome today.